I love the unrequited love between Nandini and Aditi Karikal and I think it's it's a very very different kind of love. I have romanced a lot of people in a lot of movies. It's always been one sided love or you love both of it's mutual. But this is the first time that there's one person who loves him so much he can kill him. And there's this other person who loves her so much he can die for her. And what happens there and I know does he die because of her? I don't know. Or does he live? You don't know. That is a very beautiful thought. And in the book too, it almost has a... It's not finished. It's left there for us to conjure up some image in our minds. And Marisa has wrapped it up so beautifully and I just love it. And working with her was phenomenal. I loved it. And once again, it was nice sharing screen, screen space and that chemistry with her. I completely echo uh, his sentiments. And um, who better than to actually... Uh, bring that kind of dynamic on celluloid than Manigaru. He is king of uh, bringing romance into the most tense moments in, in a manner which is just so unique to his, uh, his storytelling, his uh, way of bringing magic that pain becomes beautiful. You see love, you see intensity and the ultimate romance in the moments that when written on paper does not read like that but is definitely experienced like that. And uh, we're so fortunate to have had the, no, to, to have that creative opportunity to, uh, to live those moments. Thank you. It's truly magical. I have an extension to this question, Vivek Maria. Uh, how did you get into this space of Nandini, who's smitten everyone? You know, now when it was on screen, there was a sense of proud, you know, proud. <coughs> like, yes. This is someone right here. So how did you get in space? You know, Isn't in that space? amazing? First, to begin with in Kalkisa's writing, yeah. that this lady is just so... Um, the way she's been written in as a character, as a personality, um, it's just amazing that all the women also in the audience, apart from, I mean, I mean the readers to begin with, uh, absolutely love this character. There's a strange relatability, strange, because uh, I think deep down, all of us know that um, we're grey. It's not black and white. Everybody is grey. Everybody uh, is layered as a personality. And, um, and that's just the, the deepest truth. So in life, actually, um, there are no labels. There is no compartmentalization about... Uh, being a protagonist or an antagonist or are you are you positive or are you negative they, these are all labels that I think we as people go about um, attached to me and uh, today and that was with Sanjay Bansali ji mm. and today of course with my Mani Garu I got to play Nandini in Pony and Selvan I mean that's that's just mm. tremendously uh, a blessing uh, to have gotten to play such strong women such uh, layered women and uh, women with um, with character that touches the lives of so many women out there. There is a relatability. So I'm very, very, very grateful. Hi, Mani, this is uh, Runa from uh, Last time when we spoke about it, that we should be looking into our history and feel proud about it. So whenever you make a film like this, it's a visual documentation for the new generation. Do you, while making the film, does it somewhere uh, give a pressure on you or does it inspire you? Just go ahead. You, whatever film you make, you try to make it as well as you can. But when you make a period film and when it is uh, historical, though it's a historical fiction, once it's an historical thing, you try to go as close as you can to what could have been and not fantasize it not uh, add elements which are not too real but try to bring it you know as close to reality as possible this film was treated in that fashion and the objective while making was simple that uh, it should look like it is happening now or it should look like we are there next to the characters so it was shot it was scored it was put together it was performed casually not like a historical drama so everything added to that thank you hi hi good evening from bollywood chronicle this side right ma'am this side right left left side ma'am